Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're driving through downtown Kingston and we're going to look at the oceanfront property by the Kingston Harbour. Okay, on the left is the Bank of Jamaica building and straight ahead is the Jamaica Conference Centre. Now this is the largest conference centre in Kingston. It's actually the second largest conference center in Jamaica. Only the Montego Bay Convention Center in Montego Bay is larger. This conference center is where you have all the functions, conventions, anywhere that you need a very large area. On the left is the Bank of Jamaica building. This is the entrance that the commercial trucks would use, like the armored cars and go in and drop off and collect money. This gate here on the left is where the staff would use the staff entrance to go in and come up. Straight ahead now is the Kingston Harbour. This is the seventh largest natural harbour in the world and one of the most beautiful places in Jamaica. You can see numerous ships out in the harbour waiting to dock at Kingston Port. So naturally these office buildings, residential buildings have a beautiful view of the harbour. So this is the prime oceanfront property in Jamaica. On the left is the convention centre and then coming up now the white building that's under construction is the Oceana Hotel. I'm not sure if the hotel is going to be renamed that Oceana but it's being renovated and it's going to be operated as a hotel and the Kingston Harbour on the left there is work in progress to bring cruise ships in to dock at, in this area of Kingston Harbour On the left is Ocean 7, it's a restaurant complex where people go and eat and have fun. Very popular, I think they call it Victoria Pier. Very popular spot in downtown Kingston. So all these offices are prime real estate areas just because of the view to the harbour. can see on the left people are fishing and all sorts of activity, recreational activity. Okay, the building on the right now is the UDC building. It's a commercial building where people can rent office space and just set up their business. On the right now is a Digicel building which is the head office for Digicel in Jamaica. This is actually the head office for Digicel in the Caribbean. And on the left you can see the Kingston Harbour. So I'm going to turn back around and take on another look at the real estate the government is trying to get to redevelop the area down here you can see a lot of activity has started so they offered companies tax incentives to move the head office down to downtown Kingston and numerous companies have relocated offices down here but as you can see this is prime oceanfront property 
and with the road infrastructure improving it's very easy to get in and out of the city so there's no traffic delays Kingston is actually the largest city in Jamaica with the largest population so naturally the road infrastructure has to be top-notch for people to get in and out easily and quickly but as you can see this is prime real estate Look at these high-rise buildings. Can you imagine the view as they look out to the harbour? That's Bank of Jamaica on the left and straight ahead is the Scotia Centre, Scotia Financial Centre. And on the left is the Jamaica Conference Centre. So we're currently on Ocean Boulevard. All that prime real estate that we just passed, that's Ocean Boulevard. We're going to head up to Harbour Street and then come back around on Port Royal Street and look at the oceanfront property. So we're now on Duke Street and we're now turning right onto Harbour Street. Straight ahead is the Grace Kennedy head office on Harbour Street. And I guess that 100 means they're celebrating 100 years in Jamaica. On the left, that, this, on the, the building on the left was the original head office for the Grace Kennedy Group. And on the right is the new head office. Yeah, the building on the right now where the palm trees are this is the Jamaica Stock Exchange financial as the name says it's the they're in charge of the companies they regulate the companies on the Jamaica Stock Exchange now straight ahead this is the Ministry of Foreign Affairs we're going to get a better view of the entire building shortly, but this is the entrance. Straight ahead, that's the Grace Kennedy building from another angle. So these buildings help, are part of the Jamaica the oceanfront properties. And I'm just assuming that these buildings were built in these locations because they could have this wonderful view of the harbor and be on the ocean front. We're going to take a look at these buildings. Okay, this will give us a very nice view of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and the Grace Kennedy Building. We can get a view of these buildings now. 
that's the Air Jamaica building and then the Scotia Financial Center and then straight ahead now that's the Bank of Jamaica building alright guys thanks for watching the video remember to like share and subscribe have a good day